U.S. Department of Transportation will conduct compliance audits on every commercial trucking company. The purpose of a DOT audit is to access whether a carrier is following Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration regulations. A standard audit will evaluate the safety performance of a company and also confirm if business and its owner operators are taking part in proper record keeping. There are several different types of audits that the DOT can conduct. First, there's a compliance review. This is where the DOT will evaluate if your carrier is adhering to government regulatory processes. Plus, the agency will also review the safety performance of your company. Next, you have the new entrant audit. This audit and compliance review serve as the two most common forms of DOT audits. The new entrant audit functions as a safety audit. You can expect to experience the audit at some point during the first 12 months after your business opens. The audit will focus on ensuring that your carrier complies with all FMCSA safety regulations. A third type of audit is a DOT security audit. This audit focuses on evaluating the safety plan that your carrier uses. Plus, it also assesses your security measures and driver training protocol. Then, there is a hazardous materials audit. This is where the DOT reviews carrier policy, training shipping documentation process, and the labeling of hazardous materials. Of course, you can only expect to receive this audit if you operate a hazmat carrier. Every DOT audit and review can feature up to six inspection categories. First, there's a general inspection. This is where the commercial carriers have to provide documentation that proves they have proper liability insurance. The key is to keep a copy of your MCS90 form and make sure that the insurance provider has already signed the document. The second DOT inspection category focuses on drivers. Commercial drivers must have completed the DOT's drug and alcohol testing program and have up-to-date licensing. Your carrier has to file a signed testing program receipt from every driver. Next, there is an operational DOT review. This involves a carrier providing six months of driver logs and supporting documents. The DOT will evaluate the logs and check the recent violations. The fourth type of DOT review is a vehicle inspection. The agency will be checking to make sure that your carrier's vehicles have undergone constant maintenance, inspection, and repair. Your company must hold on to 14 months of vehicle inspection reports. Otherwise, each vehicle needs to have an approved inspection sticker. Next, let's say that you own a hazardous materials carrier. You must show proof that each driver has completed official hazardous materials transport training. Sixth and final DOT audit focuses on driver accounts. Your carrier has to keep records of each driver's accident and injury history. Keep in mind that you will not always know in advance when the DOT or FMCSA will audit your carrier. For example, one single trucking accident can alert the FMCSA to hold a compliance review. Plus. The DOT FMCSA have a reputation for conducting many roadside inspections. Violating a roadside inspection can result in your company receiving major fines and penalties. So, what major step can you take to be prepared for a DOT audit? You and your carrier must maintain updated driver qualification files. Failing to provide copies of these files is the most common fine a carrier receives during a DOT audit. To ensure that you maintain these files and all other DOT and FMCSA compliance filings, you must visit fmcsaregistration.com. Our organization provides every type of trucking management solution. This way, your carrier can maintain excellent standing with the DOT and FMCSA through an easy, streamlined process. Please click the link below and discover simple DOT audit solutions on our website. Plus, feel free to give our trucking compliance team a phone call today if you have any questions. Our number is 866-477-0707. Also, we encourage you to watch our videos about driver qualification files right now. It contains crucial information about how your carrier can maintain compliance with the DOT.